In this video, I'm gonna show you how to sequence a drum pattern and then copy it to the next pattern so that you don't have to recreate it every time you change to a new pattern. So here I am in 1.1. I've just sequenced in a simple four on the floor drum pattern. Sounds like this. And instead of going into pattern 1.2 and then having to, you know, clear it all out and re-sequence just a simple four on the floor, I can go to 1.1 I can go shift menu, okay? And it shows me the, the mute option here, but I'm gonna scroll this all the way to the right. Then I'm gonna scroll it back two places. So I just have copy. The other options are copy R, copy rhythm only, or copy bass only. So you can explore those as well if you just wanna copy one of those elements. But for the sake of this, I'm gonna copy everything. And it's saying yes, enter, or no exit. I'm gonna say yes, I wanna copy it. And then you have to choose where you want to copy it. So for this, I'm going to copy it to 1.2 and I'm going to press enter. It's done. Now I'm going to exit. And then I can see pattern 1.1, I have this, right? And then pattern 1.2, I also have this. So this is really nice because now I could build on top of pattern 1.2. For example, I could go in, I'm just going to live record. something like that, for example. So that's in pattern 1.2. Now I can go back in, shift, menu. It's already got copy ready for me. I'm gonna say yes, enter. And I'm gonna put that now in 1.3, enter, done. And then exit. Now I've got 1.2 with the hi-hats and 1.3 also with the hi-hats. So then I can sequence more stuff into 1.3 and then I start building my patterns one after another and I can start kind of building my track. So here's 1.1, just with the four on the floor. Here's 1.2. And then I can go 1.3 and you imagine I've added more to that. So straight away you have that kind of build in dynamics in your drum pattern. So I love that one. Just as a super quick recap, shift menu, which is actually the oct plus button. Um, it'll initially have it all the way over at mute. So you have to scroll it to the right over to copy. You've got enter for yes. You've got to decide where you want to put it. So scroll the uh, tempo value wheel, hit enter to copy, wait for it to say done and then exit. Have a go.